Hi, good morning. Uh, I am Dr. Fego, and um, it's nice to have it's nice to have me on your show this morning. Well, actually, concerning uh, the use of levonorgestrel, popularly called Postinol. Well, yes, the drug, as we all know, is an emergency contraceptive, but just like other uh, drugs, you know, it has to be used with caution. And uh, if it's not properly used, then uh, it might cause some problems. However, you know, this particular medication, Postinol, as it's popularly known, is something that has been misused over time, especially in this uh, part of the world. And uh, well, for my own, uh, for my own experience, I know that ladies they always like taking postnatal two, postnatal two. That some persons even believe that ah, postnatal two is if I support for some persons postnatal two is that vitamin C. They take postnatal two. They even some persons they can be if they don't eat, they prefer not to eat, and that for them to they prefer they prefer, they prefer, they prefer to actually take the postnatal two than for them not to eat. And then uh, it's good that uh, it's good that one really knows. Uh, this particular medication that they are actually using, uh, you know, that's why, that's why uh, education is very, very vital. Yes. Now, postnatal has been a lifesaver because uh, it's uh, it's an emergency contraceptive. However, postnatal no be paracetamol. I say that again. Postnatal no be paracetamol. The the particular med- the, the beauty about the drug is that when used right, it will. It will actually do what it's meant to do. I believe that we all know that already. But when it is being abused, ladies, please listen to this very well. This information is very vital. When postnatal two is being abused, what you are actually doing that you are predisposing yourself to harm, to danger, and one of those uh, danger is you are predisposed, you are increasing your risk, or you are, you are exposing yourself to cancer. Yes abuse of postnatal two can actually predispose one to cancer and cervical cancer uh, yes cervical cancer in particular that's what that's what people don't know when they abuse uh, postnatal two yes postnatal two doesn't really affect fertility but it, the, the fear is a predisposure to to uh, cancer so ladies if you want to use your postnatal two and also apart from, apart from that it also um alters one cycle and for ladies we know what that means you know it can be it can be depressing to see that uh, one is just having uh, irregular cycles uh, the time you're expecting to you know, see your monthly food you're not seeing it and something is delayed prolonged and that can also lead to anxiety depression all of that so you see that the drug needs to be used right so please for ladies if you want to use postnatal two, use it um, rightly and do not take postnatal two for like like uh, how would i put it now about seven days of the week uh, 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 some person they take postnatal two almost every five five days no 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 please don't do that it's it's not good for your health it's not good for your body so and, and also abstinence is still is still good and even though even though you still want to have sex, if you have and safe sex, and for you to want to abuse Pusina too. So that's it for ladies. If you want to use Pusina too, use it right. But please, just remember this at the back of your mind. Just put this at the back of your mind that Pusina too, no be paracetamol. Thank you. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye.